Hey folks, this is Dave Gleason. I'm head coach here at Athletic Revolution just south of Boston, Massachusetts in Pembroke. Today I want to talk to you about hip turns and how we teach hip turns to our young athletes. A little progression that uh, we've been using that's been very, very effective. Uh, of course, when you're teaching the hip turn, one of the things that we really have to get across to our young athletes is that notion or that, that concept of disassociation from the shoulders right here to the hips. So then they can take off, but they keep their shoulders and their head in the game in case they get faked out and they have to go back the other way, okay? So the first thing that we'll do is call out ones and twos. The one, boom, is here. Two, they get to go. So we break that skill up a little bit. With most of our skills in here, we try to break them down into our smallest parts first, then we layer them back in. Okay, if we need to, we back up even further and we only do the one, just the hip turn. Just the hip turn. We'll do static repeats right there. From there, we can progress a little bit more in two different ways. We can randomize which side they do the hip turn, which side one is, so we'll call one and point. One, this side. Two is always straight back. The other thing we can do is just have them go by sight, which I really like, because then they can't cheat and turn those shoulders and head right away. They've got to watch for the commands, which side, and then boom, back, which means go ahead, retreat, take off. Um, the other thing we'll do is we'll teach them or put them in a situation of how to get out of that bad position or if they do you know, fall for a fake, if they're here and they have to hip turn back the other way and go, we teach them that by we'll call out three numbers, okay? One, two, Three, boom, we'll do the same exact thing. We'll take out the audio, make it merely a visual cue. Here, 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 without the words, of course. You see how we can layer this skill, and then at the end, of course, the hope is just with pointing, and we can do it randomly, it's smooth. It's smooth. We don't have to break it up, because, of course, they need to be fluid and effective. Um, listen, I hope this little progression, this uh, explanation, helps you when you're teaching the hip turn. Vital skill for athletes in just about every sport you can imagine, especially your team sports. Uh, do yourself a favor though, if you want a lot more information on how to teach speed and agility to your young athletes, the IYCA.org, okay? International Youth Conditioning Association, IYCA.org. Go there today, tons of information. Their speed and agility uh, certification is, is so co complete, unbelievable product. Um, check it out today. This is Dave Gleason. I'm going to sign off for now. I will be back with more videos very, very soon. Thanks so much.